around to you all on uh, winning the academic ashes. Uh, a, a fantastic achievement, uh, particularly in Australia's own backyard. Now, I know this is hard to believe, but many, many years ago, I was a professional tennis player. And I did play in Australia a lot. I actually played there 10 years in a row for something like two or three months at a time. And I know that beating Australians, whether it's individual tennis players or, I'm sure, even more difficult in rugby league, beating Australians uh, outside uh, of their own country on, on the road is pretty tough. But beating them in their own backyard is, uh, is, is something special. And uh, whenever it happened to me, I always used to think it was, it was great fun. To be honest. <laughs> so I hope I'm right in thinking that winning <coughs> against Australia in Australia was great fun. Well, we're here to acknowledge and celebrate the uh, GB students winning uh, the academic ashes in Australia against the Australians. And, and that's, that's a very special achievement. So we thought it was absolutely right that we uh, put on a little celebration for the students and acknowledge their, their fantastic uh, playing and the, the fantastic achievement in Australia. How, how large an achievement do you think it is for the, for the game over here? Well, I think it's massive, you know. I think, you know, the, the, there's nothing like winning. Uh, and we all like winning against Australia. And, uh, you know, sometimes we don't win as often as we like. So, so to have the students achieve uh, a victory against the Australian students in their own backyard is something that's, that's very special. And it's a boost for the game in this country. Uh, we're very confident. Obviously, um, after playing them the first time the year before, we knew they were a really good side. But we re regrouped after that loss. You know, we're determined like, to get one over of them, especially on their own soil. And so we came together well trained hard and then we really good preparation before the tour. Where do you think the series was um, I think just the group of lads that we had together, you know, everything from the coaching staff to the physios to the players ourselves, we all got on really well on and off the field at training and the attitude was there, the determination were there and we came away with a win. And where does winning the series rank in your own playing career? has to be right at the top, just because of the build-up you know, to the tour. It's you know, what a lot of lads have gone to university for three years. We knew the tour was coming up, we've looked forward to it. And yeah, it's right up there at the top, it felt great. I won't, I won't pick out anyone particularly, I think it was a team effort. And, and not only that, you know, the staff right through to the, uh, the players were tremendous. What do you think the series really means for the student in this country? <laughs> it means absolutely everything. Um, to go to Australia and win a, a game, was, was unique to win a test series we've made history so uh, you can't be better than that uh, it's definitely got to be the best you know to beat the Aussies anyway is, is massive you know but to beat them out there and, and not let them get past us you know it was, uh, it was pretty, pretty impressive well done to all you uh, a, a really superb achievement uh, this is just a small way of acknowledging it so we're going to raise our glass and toast you the uh, the student lions the toast is the lions, the lions. Oh,